Hey, what's up YouTube? It's ICU and today I have something absolutely fantastic to share with you guys in the realm of jailbreaking, specifically pertaining to the new iOS 13.2 release and the forthcoming iOS 13 check rain jailbreak. Now I'm going to be operating under the assumption that you guys already know everything about check rain that we've talked about so far on the channel. If you guys don't or you have no clue what check rain is, check down below in the description. My full series will be linked there. So with that said, let's go ahead and hop into this. Also, if you wanna be notified the very second a jailbreak utility is released, bookmark our jailbreak status checker page. It's the first link below in the description and it will either say no like it does now if a jailbreak's not out or it will change to yes once a jailbreak is released. So we're only talking about what's new today. Hacker Luca Tedesco actually tweeted out two pictures that are of extreme interest just a few minutes ago as of recording this video. Now they're both of an iPod touch and the first one here, it's on its home screen and you'll notice that it has four additional icons that are pretty interesting. We have Checkrain, Cydia, Installer, and Zebra. Now those last three there are basically third-party package and tweak managers post jailbreak. It's how the majority of us will interact with and make use of our jailbreak as they are graphical user interfaces for again, basically managing your third party packages and tweaks. They're how you get things on your jailbreak. They're how you manage your jailbreak stuff, so to speak. So this is fantastic. I mean, we've already seen screenshots of Cydia and Zebra on jailbroken devices through Chakrain's Twitter account, but this just takes it one step further due to the second image that accompanies this tweet right here. So inside of Cydia here, this is the user interface for Cydia at the bottom, that identifying text confirms that again, this is an iPod Touch 9,1, but running iOS 13.2. So iOS 13.2 has been successfully jailbroken thanks to Check Rain. Now you might be wondering, well, when is a release coming? We're going to talk about that as well. See, things are looking like they're closer than ever because with all of these packages managers being tested on the CheckRain jailbreak, which by the way, the CheckRain app itself could also be a package manager, or it could be something else entirely for managing your jailbreak post jailbreak. We're just going to hold off on commenting on that until we have additional information. It just shows how far along in the development cycle things are getting. There's progress being made. In fact, someone actually outside of the primary development team, Sam Bingner, popular tweak developer, actually showed a video of his iPhone 10 running iOS 13.1.2 with his tweak installed. So it's a step beyond package managers at this point. We're unclear whether or not full tweak injection is working, but as you can see, the preference bundle for TetherMe is available inside of the settings app. Remember, Sam Bingner is the tweak developer behind the ever popular TetherMe tethering tweak for jailbroken devices. So we have the developers of CheckRain testing out package managers, and we also have beta builds presumably being tested by tweak developers. You don't do that unless a jailbreak is far enough along in development to justify it. We don't know exactly when a release is coming, but it definitely seems imminent at this point. Remember, unforeseen complications could come up that may push back this jailbreak's release. So I'm not saying that it's going to be released anytime soon. I'm not saying it's going to be released tomorrow or even a week from now. We just don't know. Remember, they want to make sure that they get this thing right. This is going to be a tethered jailbreak that makes use of the Checkmate boot ROM exploit. They want to do this thing properly so that way you don't end up with a brick when you try to jailbreak your device. That is ever crucial. So it might take a little bit more time, but they're really, really moving along in the development cycle and I would not be surprised if it does happen to drop any day. Remember, it could come at absolutely any second at this point. So just be sure to subscribe if you have yet to because I'm going to let you guys know the very second a jailbreak drops, we'll have full tutorials and complete coverage since this jailbreak is going to be unlike anything we've seen for years. So I'm excited. Let me know whether you guys are in the comments and until next time, this is ICU signing out.